Today we're going to talk about how kids are bombarded with the sweet tastes from the very get-go. Hey there, NJRoot22.com here with another kind of low-carb keto carnivore chat. But today it's, uh, it's about kids, really. And for starters, I, I talked about in a, a few uh, months ago that um, I really believe the actual taste of anything sweet is just not good for your brain. It doesn't matter what kind of sweetener it is, if it's, uh, you know, whatever, um, as long as it's not, uh, it doesn't matter. There's good uh, artificial sweeteners, so they say, and bad ones. I think they're all bad, personally. Um, but I, I noticed that uh, everything that that's given to kids is, is sweet, you know? You got, like, their toothpaste. That's like one of the first things they, uh, they have to do uh, two or three times a day is brush their teeth. And they have berry, they have bubble gum, they have uh, ice cream flavor, whatever the hell the flavors are. They're all sweet. I taste them. You know, I taste all my kids' stuff. Um, and it, I, of course, I don't buy the ones with uh, fluoride in it, but that, that doesn't matter. It's just you're giving them this sweet sensation, and it just triggers all sorts of brain responses. And I just think it's uh, you know, a thousand times a year they're putting something sweet in their mouth, even if it's zero calorie, it's not bad for the teeth. It's just a signal being sent through the taste buds into the brain. I think it's a very bad uh, precedent to start. Just give them mint toothpaste, even though, that, I mean, that's not really sweet, but whatever. And the next thing is the, these stupid uh, gummy vitamins. Uh, you know, they're all branded to kids and Toy Story princesses and all this other stuff. Um, I think it's the worst invention ever, gummy vitamins. It literally is um, candy. Um, and with a... Uh, Good diet. You, you technically, really, in a modern American diet, I mean, a, a healthy American diet, low carb, you really don't really need to take any vitamin su supplements. And I'm sure some kids don't probably eat their proper diet, but if you, and then they might be benefit a little bit from a, a vitamin. Um, but our kids don't need them, and I don't know. I don't want to give them to them anymore. It's not. It wasn't my idea. I think uh, we need to stop. I think it's unnecessary and it's just a candy. They beg for the gummy vitamins and that's, it's absolutely awful. And one of the other things that's just truly bad, it's not necessarily always particularly sugary sweet, but it's really high in carbs, and that's breakfast cereals. Granola, you got all sorts of uh, sweet, sweet things. And it's, I mean, one bowl of kid's cereal usually has more uh, carbs than I eat in a week. Um, it's just really, really bad. And of course, I, it's that whole cross marketing with the kids' characters on it too, which really kills me. It's just they go nuts when they when they uh, eat a bowl of cereal. And and I could go on and on. There's a thousand other uh, bad things that you could give kids, but um, one of them that I, I really just don't like doing is uh, juice juices, especially like juice box. I mean, you could weed out and find some juices that are, you know substantially lower in sugar and carbs than, but the, the main juices, they're packed, packed with, um, with high amounts of sugar and carbs. And I really just don't, uh, I mean, my kids become nuts when they, when they drink juice. And I water it down too, a half at least, uh, sometimes more, you know, at least I'm easing them into, into things. But I mean, at the, at the least, if you need to give your child fruit, um, just give them whole fruit. But then again, I mean, I, I give my kids half an apple and they, they turn into like little tornadoes. It just goes straight, straight to their <clears throat> whatever. I don't know. What do you think? I, I think teaching kids low carb would be good, but you need support from everybody in the family. And it's not always easy when you don't have the support because uh, a lot of people still believe that, oh, balanced diet and this and that, that's a bunch of crap. But I'll keep trying. At least my kids are on the low end of the bell curve for now. Um, and that's it. If you like uh, the video, please hit the subscribe and the bell and all that other stuff, and I will see you next week.